Scare in the air and on the ground tonight, Atlanta's own Delta Airlines expressing concern for dozens of children and adults after a Delta pilot was forced to dump fuel on them while making an emergency landing in Los Angeles. The jet fuel rained down on people at schools and neighborhoods in the landing path, causing minor injuries and major worries. Yeah, you can see why a lot of families are concerned here. Tonight, as John Sherrick explains, we're working to find out what questions the FAA is asking about whether the pilot had any other options. The sight shocked witnesses. Fuel spewing out of a Delta airliner and onto Los Angeles. Delta Flight 89 had just taken off from the Los Angeles airport. Suddenly, the pilot radioed the tower declaring an emergency, saying he had to shut down an engine. Delta telling us later that as the pilot circled back to LAX, he had to dump his jet fuel in order to land safely. The fuel raining on four elementary schools and on residential neighborhoods near the airport. As many as 60 people, mostly children, complained of skin irritation and burning eyes and other minor injuries. My head started hurting first, but then my eye itched. FAA regulations are strict about fuel releases, normally allowing them over unpopulated areas only and at high altitudes so the released fuel immediately evaporates. But the FAA does provide for exceptions in emergencies. Delta in Atlanta emailing us. We share concerns regarding reported minor injuries to adults and children at a school in the area. Delta so far has not offered any details about what caused the engine failure, but points out the plane did land safely and that the airline is in touch with authorities in Los Angeles about the potential impacts of the jet fuel in the next few days on health and the environment.